It is uh, uh, differences within the family, but it, it's taken on this uh, politicized nature, which is dividing the family in, a, in a, an unprecedented way. Because Israel, as Prime Minister Netanyahu said yesterday, has always been a bipartisan issue in American politics. And, and unfortunately, uh, the way the uh, speech came about uh, has, has politicized it and created a, a division between Democrats and Republicans. I think he's made it clear that uh, sight unseen, because the deal isn't done yet, uh, he will uh, do whatever he can to torpedo it. Um, and, and so I think his, his best leverage in that regard is, is through Congress. Uh, but a Republican-controlled Congress can't uh, veto the president's uh, uh, deal uh, unless it has a, a veto-proof majority in both houses. And that requires a lot of Democrats to be on board uh, against their own president. Uh, so I think it's going to be very hard uh, for him to pull that off. What Israel loses is the ability to engage with the administration about the details of the deal and uh, gain strategic reassurances from the administration to help protect Israel from the downsides of the deal. Uh, and and I, I see that as perhaps the most uh, problematic ongoing uh, cost of, of this battle between two allies is that Israel in the process will rob itself of the ability uh, to uh, get the United States to take steps that can help alleviate Israel's concerns.